Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. In this episode, we're going to be talking about Tesla post stock split, and we're going to be talking about Tesla pre battery day. Battery day is supposed to have a whole bunch of great news coming out, and Elon Musk is already driving up the price and uh, speculation on what's to be announced during the battery day. Battery day is on September 22nd, so we're going to talk about Tesla uh, leading up to September 22nd to see what kind of trades can we make on it pre-battery day. Also, stick to the end of this video so that you don't miss out on Tesla market analysis. I'm gonna go through the, uh, the charts and draw all the lines to make it a little bit easier for you guys. But before we dive into that, this video is brought to you by Webull. Sign up now and deposit $100 into your account and receive a free share valued up to $1,600. That could be your free share of Tesla right there to help you get started. The link is down in the description. But enough talking, let's go on ahead and get straight into the video. All right, here we are on Robinhood. Right now, Tesla is at $423.45 at the recording of this video. They had an insane day going up almost 13%. Well, a little over 13% in just one day. Pre-stock split, I had one share of Tesla, right? And I had a five to one split. That means now I have five shares of Tesla on the day that they had their stock split, which brought me to five shares. And then the same day that they had a stock split, I'm gonna show you guys right here. I bought two more shares of Tesla at $439 and 67 cents. That order was filled. So now that brings me to a total of 7.33 shares of Tesla. So that's a pretty good size position. It takes up 11.37% of my entire portfolio. The market value that I have of Tesla from only seven shares is $3,104.96, with my average cost being $212.73. So I did get in pretty early on Tesla, which makes my average cost pretty low. My total return is up $1,545 dollars and 12 cents up 100 percent all right i'm up 99 percent I, I was just trying to round it up uh, it sounded pretty cool but i'm up 99.06 percent hopefully by tomorrow i'll end up being up 100 percent so that is my tesla portfolio post split i know a lot of you guys was wondering i had that one share it split into five the price dropped down to four hundred dollars and now i have purchased two more shares the same day that had split and then it like has shot up to like five hundred dollars i should have sold at the top but uh i'm just going to continue to hold on to the tesla until the truck come out and then i'll probably sell some of those shares to help me buy the tesla truck so yes i did pre-order the tesla truck so hopefully that'll get come in late 2022 something like that so yeah that is my tesla portfolio okay so how are we going to play the tesla battery day event that is coming up well it's no secret if i know that means it's pretty common knowledge that uh, everything elon musk is talking about that there might be a cheaper price model 2 car coming out the million uh the million mile battery if it's stuff like that is floating around that we already know about that i know about then it's coming knowledge to everybody so that is already hyping up the price right now the only way that the price is going to just explode during battery day if they announced a million mile battery uh, I don't think stock would explode because we already predicting that they're going to announce the million mile battery. So it's not going to be any news that was just out of the blue. But now if Elon Musk come out on battery day and announce something just completely out of the blue that no one expected at all, then I can see the stock price shooting through the roof but it has to be something just completely insane that nobody seen coming at all and that would be information that us everyday people don't have any kind of clue about also if they come to uh, battery day and they announce everything that we already kind of predicted about uh, the price of new cars or they really don't have any new technology that he thought was going to be some cool technology but to everyday consumers it's not really that cool or if they mark any kind of delays on cars and trucks that are coming out off the million mile battery is not announced at all then that can actually drive the price down so what we're gonna do, we're gonna hop into Think or Swim right quick, draw up the market analysis on Tesla just to see how can we swing trade, day trade Tesla on the way leading up to battery day. So let's go ahead and pull up Think or Swim and dive into these charts right quick. 
All right, YouTube, here we are on Think or Swim. This is Tesla TSLA. Uh, we have the, the four hour 180 day chart pulled up. I mean, this is the price of Tesla over the last 180 days and every bar represents four hours of trading of Tesla. So if we want to see how Tesla might trade over the next couple of days, uh, we're gonna draw a line right here because Tesla like to have a double top. And I'm gonna explain to you guys what a double top is right quick. So let's go ahead and draw that line and zoom in right here. This will be an easy way to see a double top. So if it comes right here, bam and bam. So Tesla comes up, touches this line, get rejected, come back down and touches this line and get rejected again. That is considered a double top. It was a top right here. And then a top right there is like two boobies, okay? So let's go ahead and zoom back out to the current price where we're at right now. Okay, so Tesla could come all the way back up here over the next couple of days leading up to battery day. So that would be a nice, decent swing trade if it does come up here to double top at the top. If no good news come out at battery day, then I could see Tesla being a double top at $538. But if you swing trade it from today on forward, you could have a percent gain of around 24, 23% over the course of the next couple of weeks, over the next couple of days if you guys wanted to take that swing trade. Now, let's draw a uptrend pattern right quick on Tesla. From here, all the way up and out. Okay, so I drew that because Tesla touches once right here. It bounced, came and touched again right here. It bounced off of it, and then it bounced one more time right here. So I mean, Tesla is really rejecting falling below this uptrend line right here. I mean, it's showing a sign of support. It doesn't necessarily have to stick to it. So Tesla could trade anywhere in between its old resistance right here, which would be the double top, and its old support. So over the next couple of weeks, Tesla could go down, right there, come back up, come back down, touch that line again, and then come all the way back up to eventually have a double top over the next couple of weeks. So I really see Tesla trading in between this upward channel over the next couple of days, the next couple of weeks until leading up to battery day. So this is a, a little quick market analysis, nothing really much too in depth. I didn't really go over the RSI or the MACD indicator. This is just a simple trend lines that I'm drawing out to help the very simple traders out there keep track of Tesla price points and how it's going to trade over the next couple of days. Could it fall below this line? Of course it could fall below this line. If it do, its last resistance line uh, going sideways would be this level right here because it had a hard time breaking above that double top right there. And then it touches once again right here. So around $330 would be its old resistance line. Could it fall back down to $330? Yes, it could. But I see leading up to Tesla, I mean, leading up to Tesla battery day and me knowing Elon Musk, you know, I know him personally, me and Elon, we go way back. But uh, I see eventually that's gonna have a double top sooner than later. Uh, if it does pull back to 330, I will pick up maybe a share or two of Tesla. And then hopefully on Tesla battery day, they have a big announcement to drive the price all the way back up to $538.75, giving me a percent gain of around 20, 25%. So, so that's how I'm gonna treat Tesla over the next couple of weeks leading up to battery day. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna be talking about Tesla leading up to battery day. And then also I'm gonna talk about all the announcements on battery day. And then I'm gonna talk about Tesla post battery day. So if you don't want to miss out on any of these videos, make sure that you hit the thumbs up on this video. It lets me it lets me know that you guys are enjoying these Tesla videos and then it really helps out this channel more than you can even imagine. Trust me by just hitting the thumbs up button, it really helps me out. Also, if you want to help out, subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on any future videos. But other than that, I'm Zeke bringing you the Dream Green Show and I'm out. Peace.